Hey guys, I'm here with Falconer Chase Young, and he is gonna tell us some items you need to get started in the sport of falconing. So what do we have here? Some of the most basic things you'll need. You've gotta have a glove to be able to hold them on your hand to keep their talons, of course, from going into the skin. Leather, uh, this actually is kangaroo leather, and the reason we use it is it's about as strong as leather can get for how light it is. We'll use this to make their jesses, um, which is this part and then the anklets, basically on the bird's leg right there. So with that, you'll need something to cut it with. This will allow you to cut the strips, make them even. Um, you can do it by hand, but this just makes it a little cleaner. Going into the toolbox, you'll need grommets. And the grommets is what we'll put on the anklet so you can run the jesses through. So you'll need that. You'll need the grommet pliers, and then of course, you'll need a way to put a hole in that leather to start. You're going to need a hood. It makes things a lot easier when you either trap a bird or for instance, you want a bird to sit properly on a table. Uh, you can put that hood on it, it'll keep it calm. A bell, that's something you can put on and as you learn, when you hear that in the field, something's happening. Scale, one of the most important things in falconry. Uh, it allows you to weigh your bird, um, which has to be done basically daily. And so that makes sure you've got your bird in that healthy uh, balance that you know that it'll fly the best at. Of course, your telemetry. Now this is optional, but as you saw, when the birds are chasing stuff, they can catch something, and without it, it'd make it really difficult to find stuff. Right. Two other things would be the giant hood, which is okay. this box here. Mm -hmm. Put the bird in it and that's good for transportation. And then of course, lastly, the perch um, for your viewer weathering yard. And the last thing is this. What would that be for? Well, it's a dead bird, so I'm assuming like food? Food, that's it, exactly. So when you get inspected by TWRA, they're gonna come out and that's just to make sure that uh, you have a, a good enough supply to get your bird started until you're actually able to start hunting. When you become an apprentice and you take your falconry exam, these things are actually listed on it. And once you've accumulated everything, uh, you've been inspected, uh, you're able to go trap a bird and you have everything you need. All right guys, do you know anyone who would want to get into falconry? Let us know in the comments. And for more videos of this awesome trip, be sure to check out our new Snapchat Discover channel. I'm Paxton Elrod. And I'm Chase Young.